it is very clear that the head of the snake is the financial system. The mechanism is finance. The whole point of finance is to indebt, otherwise to enslave. What is a mortgage? I mean, what does that stand for? It's a death grip. So when you get a mortgage, you have a death grip held over you because you are in debt. You don't even own the house. The bank owns the house that loans you the money to buy the house unless you're fortunate enough to have all the money to buy it outright. And even then, you can be taxed by the government. And if you fail to keep up with those taxes, the government can then take it from you. The whole system is based on a financial fraud, which effectively takes the power that we have, and it gives it to a tiny group of individuals who are running the world through the control of finance. With the infinite supply of money that we have allowed them to take, they have literally an infinite supply supply of money and with that money and from their psychopathic point of view they have bought everything and everyone who can be bought so those of us who cannot be bought because we operate on a level that goes way beyond the material we are not rewarded for such behavior we are punished for such behavior and the most slovenly disgustingly criminal corrupt moral individuals those are the ones that are rewarded in this system which is upside down so we reward the corrupt we reward the liars we reward the people with no morals at all and usually we compromise them under this system in terms of maybe a videotape maybe Barack Obama is gay if I was in charge of the world and I was a psychopath and completely drunk on my own power, you can bet damn sure that's what I would do. I wouldn't allow anyone in a position of power who wasn't completely compromised.